Hi, welcome back to another episode of VRB Wing. Today I'll be taking a look at Air Brigade, which is an arcade jet fighter shooter out on the Oculus Go. I'd like to give a big thanks to the game developer for letting us have the code to be able to make this video. Without wasting any more time, let's jump in and have a look. And here we are in. Oh, and straight away someone's got a lock on me. On the right. So I'm flying, I think it's a MiG-29. This game did have a lot. No, I'm dead, I think. Enemy oh, shook him. Warning. Enemy locked off. I think he's got me. No, I've managed to take him off. Warning. Enemy you can Enemy also locked play um, Team Deathmatch and this play online. Die. Die. Ah. Die. 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 As you see, I didn't do too well on that. Made absolutely no money. So what I'll do this time, I'll change that over to Team Deathmatch. We're in the hangar here. I can easily change planes between the different ones that I have brought. Well, I'll stick with the MiG-29. I've only got, I think, three planes unlocked at the moment. Including the one that I've started with. Here we go. Team Deathmatch. Four minutes gameplay. Three on three. And we're in. So they do have um Three different locations you can fly in. There's my teammate, there's two of them. Different views, whatever you prefer. I like the old classic arcade style view. You still get see around you, the cockpit view makes it harder, but it gives you a better sense that you're in the play. I never do tend to recommend these sort of games to people What's that are this? new to VR. Get what you call VR sickness pain. Like, like right, the same sort of effect as in, in roller coasters, you are throwing the pain about. That said, this ain't as bad as some of the games for motion sickness or VR sickness. Some of them are quite intense. Unless it's just me getting more and more used to it. The controls for the game are ever so simple, it's just tilt the control and direction you want to go. Bank your plane before turning to get a, to turn quicker. Pull the trigger to shoot your missiles once you've got a lock on. To take an enemy missile off. There he is, there he is. The easiest way is just to head into a dive. Sometimes you can roll them off, but not always. The more planes you kill, the more money you get. The more money you get, the more planes you can buy. Ah, sugar, I think it's got me. It's got me. Boom! I will leave the link to the game in the description as always so if you ever decide you want to buy it and give it a go just click on the link it's available for the Oculus Go I ah, see him I think my mate, teammate will get him before me he's a lot closer than I am yeah. Oh, 
again. Classic dog fighting style, top gun experience. I do like the fact that you do get quite a choice on aeroplanes. Go away. Now each plane does fly very differently and have different advantages. Some are more stealth, some are faster, some are more maneuverable. So it's not just a case of just going and buying the most Ooh. expensive plane, it's also done. finding the one most suited to your game style. Too bad of a game. They can change the time of play, game length, style of game, from team death match to a battle royale style. Three locations, if I remember. One, two, three. Yeah, three different locations, and you can alter the amount of players. So I'm going offline mode, so it's using bot. You can play online. I ain't tried it yet. Mind play. We'll best do it offline. To make a video. Yeah. Yeah. We have got three different planes so far. There are a lot more planes. If you dip into the hangar, have a look. How more money you earn, the more planes you can buy. This is real view it, wrapping it up. Thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed the video and you ain't done so already, hit that subscribe button for me. Leave a like, comment below, like it, hate it, what do you think? And that's me out. Thank you very much.